Happy August 14th, everyone. I'm Liam, and we are playing the 2024 Quest Calendar, the Leaf Riders of Renwood. Yesterday, Ivy rallied the townsfolk against an insect attack on the mushroom town of Longwatch. We defeated most of the insects, but one was able to flee to rally its allies. And that is where we left things. So, let's see what adventure is on the calendar for us today. The insects halt their attack and start to retreat. You notice they are carrying away pieces of the mushroom buildings they tore apart. There's three of them here. We're going to attack the insects and then decipher their intentions. Okay. Some more combat. Attack the insects. Some of the insects don't seem to have heard their orders to retreat and have stuck around to continue harassing the villagers. Enemy one. The mosquito-like insect darts towards you with a high-pitched whine, attempting to sink its needle-like proboscis into your skin, draining your health with each successful strike. That sounds familiar. Uh, okay, we need to beat a defense of 16. We get 11, uh, plus our attack of 7 is 18. We hit him, and now we want to do 16 points of damage or more of 10 plus 2 is 12 can we get four more damage somehow um we have yeah we've got our soul we can do this how do we want to do it we have three party members and we have uh we have solar flare we need four more points let's see let's try the party members we've got we need four points, and we have um, Vinny, Brindle, and Kit. Vinny, we'd need two of these guys to come through. Vinny does one point. Uh, Brindle, oh, plus three, and Kit plus D four. So Kit alone could do it if we roll, if we get the right card and the right die roll. So here we go, Kit. We need a club greater than or equal to six. Nope. <laughs> okay. How about, um, okay, we'd need both Brindle and Vinny to come through. So let's try, try Brindle. Well, um, let's try Vinny first. Mm, this is a hard choice. If Brind, if one, let's see. Yeah, if one, if one doesn't succeed. So the deal is we can only use these guys once per page. So not only are they really unlikely to succeed, <laughs> you don't get to use them very much. So, uh, let's try Vinny first. Vinny needs a seven of clubs or better. Oh, he gets it. All right, but it's also, oh dear. Yep, okay, so Vinny adds his damage. He, but he's down to zero health. Now, the way the rules are written, Vinny is dead, I think. <laughs> or he's at least out. We lose him as a party member. Way back early on, I decided that wasn't going to be the case. And I just decided to treat health as energy. So, Vinny's wiped out. We can't use him at all again until we take a rest somewhere. So, uh, I don't know how I'm going to remember that. I'm just going to try to remember that. But... There's uh, plus one damage. Now let's see if Brindle can come through for us. Needs a club greater than or equal to six. Oh, it's a club, but not enough. So, uh, good try, Brindle. But that gets us one point. We need three more points. And uh, Ivy has solar something. Solar flare. Where is it? Here it is. Use one surge, add D4. To a single roll so we need three we can use this three times oh we got it four excellent so we'll mark off that we used one surge and um that's the first enemy defeated enemy two the insect stabs at you with a long spear let's see we want to let's get some of these dice out of here Beat his defense of 15 easily. We do that damage. We want to get 12 or better. 8 plus 2 is 10. 
Uh, we need another two. We've tried all our party members, so let's use another solar infusion or solar flare one <laughs> and two. There goes all our solar flares. So we beat two enemies uh, and we have nothing left to help us with damage. So, is that right? Vinnie Brindle kit and our solar flares. Yep. Um, it also means I can't use my healing light, which I was thinking of <laughs> because they're down to 16 health, but there's just one of these guys left. Enemy three, the insect stabs at you with a long spear. <laughs> okay. Uh, we're getting really, um, I think we're running out of ideas on how the insects attack us. <laughs> with damage, we want to beat his armor of 17 and we do. And now we want to do 15 points of damage or more. That's, we get it. So we've defeated all three insects. Um, if you killed three enemies, collect D6 Amber. Excellent. Two. <laughs> right. That takes us to 11, which is pretty fantastic considering we were flat broke last week. And... Step two, decipher their intentions. Roll d20 plus wisdom. Reminder, student. We are not a student. Uh, we have Ivan, who is a student, who could help us. So let's see what we get here. 15. Uh, our wisdom is plus two. That's 17. That's the best result. You recognize a pattern in the insect's behavior. They're systematically dismantling the mushroom buildings to extract particular components. It becomes evident that these components are being carried away with purpose, likely serving some function within the insect hierarchy. While you may not fully grasp the insect's goals, you understand that this retreat is not a sign of defeat, but a strategic maneuver with its own set of implications. You're going to need to continue to observe and follow them closely. Gain a plus two bonus on your rolls on the next page. Okay, I'm going to put this marker in there to try to remember that. Plus two bonus, and I'm going to write it down here. Plus two bonus to all rolls, right? On rolls, I'm going to say all rolls, uh, August 15th. Alrighty. Well, that, my friends, is August 14th. So we shall say goodbye for now and visit Ivy and friends again tomorrow. I hope you will join us. Thanks for watching.